For the first time in history, people and machinery are working together, realizing a dream. A uniting force that knows no geographical boundaries without regard to race, creed, or color. A new era where communication truly brings people together. This is the dawn of the net. Want to know how it works? Click here to begin your journey into the net. Now exactly what happened when you clicked on that link? You started a flow of information. This information travels down into your own personal mailroom where Mr. IP packages it, labels it, and sends it on its way. Each packet is limited in its size. The mailroom must decide how to divide the information and how to package it. Now the package needs a label containing important information such as sender's address, receiver's address, and the type of packet it is. Because this particular packet is going out onto the internet, it also gets an address for the proxy server, which has a special function, as we'll see later. The packet is now launched onto your local area network, or LAN. This network is used to connect all the local computers, routers, printers, etc. for information exchange within the physical walls of the building. The LAN is a pretty uncontrolled place and, unfortunately, accidents can happen.